Hello, hi. Welcome back. Lockdown free from London. The gaffs are all closed. So what we're doing is now is photo shoot and video shoots for my YouTube channel called Dom's Corner at House. Smoke, chat and chill is the concept of what we're going to do and um, talk about everything and anything that what my guest wants to talk about. So, i.e. this is a demo. Yogesh cameraman, come here. Our first guest, Yogesh, Yogi, I call him. My front of house at Dom's place. And um, yeah, this is my podcast. Hello, hi Yogesh. Hi. How are you? Not bad, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Um, due to this lockdown reasons, obviously, as you know myself, mm -hmm. at Dom's place, yeah. we're at Dom's place. And we have lockdown, so now we're gonna do a daily podcast mm -hmm. on the situation and uh, trending stuff that we're in right now um, so yeah how have you been affected by this lockdown three well I think it's like a massive impact on our life first yeah. of all when you work here uh, when you spend time here you know the business is already got impacted by COVID and the government policy I would say because they are not uh, business friendly you know mm -hmm. on top of that like uh, I have some you know such stuff parallelly so again this doing this virtually is a kind of challenge but yeah you need to cope up with everything you know but hopefully the situation get better now okay um, what is your solution to this lockdown three right now is there I don't think they have um, gave us an opening date or time yeah I know I know so for this lockdown, I would say they need to put the tier according to borrow, so that you know tier uh, according to borrow. Yeah. Borrow. So for this London, for this lockdown, they already announced tier three for all all the thirty two borrows in London, right? Yeah. So but how long is this the tier situation? Four? Is in uh, north is different, so they have lockdown according to area. Mm -hmm. So for particular borrow, they have tier three. Another one, they have tier two. So I think that would help. That would help. Yeah. Okay, so it is for businesses to grow up, you know. So, so they are already so hampered by this situation. Yeah. So what are you gonna do now, according to the lockdown and there's no trade for you or front of house? Like how much of a messed up situation you're in due to this? Well, obviously the financial situation is critical, but again, you have to use this time to prepare better, you know. Yeah. To prepare. How would better we? For how would? How challenges. would we? How would we prepare? How would we prepare for the next, if there is going to be a lockdown again? How would we be able to, as people or business owners or workers, to prepare for the next lockdown? What do we have to do, Dragon? Again, I think we need to think parallel to the government policy, yeah. but because they, they didn't any uh, disclose anything, what the lockdown duration will be, yeah. or what kind of help they're going to provide to the businesses. So we need to all of them or we need to check with them what yeah. they actually have and then try to bring new ideas so that we can cope up with this, any solution for these problems yes what I how long can you survive without a job for, without how long would you be able to survive without the job like how long would you be able to survive this lockdown have you got enough resources to survive your rental your food your traveling cost and xyz would you be able to survive without work uh, I don't reckon how long that would be, but yeah, it won't be longer because yeah, as you know, you need to cover your expenses. So, so how long have you got savings to cover your expenses for? Would be a few more months or a few more months. Yeah. So a few more months. If it goes like this, your funds would be literally done. And what would your solution be after two months? Well, again, uh, again, I have some. Uh, education loan so I need to use this money from that, that source okay but again you have to pay some interest you know so okay that's the back of plan so you've got you've got some loans that you could get yeah but again how would you be able to pay your loans if you haven't got no work uh, so so thinking that the situation is temporary for a few months yeah after working that I think thinking positive obviously yeah, thinking obviously, that hopefully yeah. what does it take only, yeah, only what do you think of this covid thing right now what do you think of the vaccine what do you think of the existence of this covid 19 well hopefully at least if they approve the vaccine the people should have do you believe in covid uh, do you believe in what the media is saying it's 50 50 chances because you know 
if I'm working, like I'm traveling, I'm working, but I haven't catch COVID, so again, it's because there are like thousands of people dying as well, so it's, there is a like 50 50 chances, but again, if they approve the vaccine, they should have rolled out uh, as soon as possible. So that, you know? No, do you believe in COVID or not? It's again 50 50. Okay, would you, are you going to get the vaccine? Yeah, I would get it. Yeah, you would get it. Yeah. So it's something that because you're gonna get. You're gonna get vaccine for something that you don't fifty. You fifty fifty believe in. Yeah, because uh, again, this told that uh, when the vaccine gonna roll uh, roll out, uh -huh. they're gonna compensate the vaccine. So sooner or later, I have to be vaccinated. You know. So what do you mean they're gonna compensate for vaccine? So they're gonna compulsory vaccine after five or six months. Every should one. Every should one get vaccine because you know just to stop this spread of coronavirus. Okay, so you don't believe in something, but um, you're yeah, going to get the vaccine. You have to because uh, yeah, the, the people who control you is, is the people that control you. Yeah. As in, who, so, so who controls you, <laughs> Yoji? Laws, you know? Laws control yeah. you. Yeah. Who's the laws? The laws that what people write for their own benefits? Uh, I'm not sure for their own benefits. Again, it's this, you know, it's, they have huge responsibility, you know, to control all the area, all the country, all the people in the, like 66 million, so I'm not sure because I'm not kind of political, I know. I don't I'm not political yeah. either, I'm just trying yeah, to ask know, the public on their point of view to to this whole COVID malarkey of lockdown free, we all fucked and um, basically if we don't get no grant or if we don't open anytime soon, we all fucked, do you know, know what I mean? I've got no money and bailiff come to my door, yes, go today for something that they said that it's no win, no fee. So now I had to pay money that I didn't have in my pocket, so I had to go and borrow it from someone else, and it's all fucked up right now. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So I want to be the voice of the public and share content on a daily basis regarding this um, matter, you know? Yeah. So that's it. Really. Thank you for coming on the show. Thank you. I hope oh. people will watch this. See you. And the um, oh. thing would go. See you later, man. Look after yourself, mate. See you tomorrow.